The difference in people, ethnic differences should be should be and it should be fought with. We should not allow foreigners to come and divide us when we have been together. We share many things in common. We share blood even. Hardly any one of us here you will see that has no flying blood. And uh, this is very unfortunate when we start dividing ourselves on these basic uh, ethnic differences. So I thank the government of uh, Dr. Mutawale that is taking precedence in establishing a ruga in a modern way and uh, I hope Allah will give him the power to complete this project Amen. and also the project to be an example for the rest of the country and other governors to follow. Amen. I also expect the federal government also to chip in and bring in things that can improve this and we can see that peace will prevail in a very short time, shorter than we, couldn't, uh, we, we, we perceive. So thank you very much for this visit. Uh, inshallah, I look forward to come and see the day we celebrate the opening of this Ruga. The whole society, the government, the religious leaders, the traditional leaders, politicians, the security men, they will have all to work in unison. There is no question about everybody doing his own. We have to work in unison. And this example shows us that it's not always with force that we can enforce peace. Sometimes you have to uh, use peace to attract people to embrace peace. And this is an example we have seen, and we hope it will be spreading all over the nation. Yes, the idea is that these bandits are actually an insurgency. Sometimes it's not even criminal. It may have started as criminal, but it turned into an insurgency. An insurgency, you cannot quell it with a gun. You have to negotiate, you have to dialogue. Why are they going into insurgency? Is because they are marginalized. They don't have any amenities, they don't have anything, and uh, it turned into an ethnic conflict, which we don't want it to escalate and continue. So we are calling on everybody to chip in to see how we can bring the people all together. Sir, what is your impression of the Ruga project? I think it's an excellent, it's an excellent project which if we have it all spread all over, then it will solve the problem of uh, migration of cattle. Because they are settled and they will have all the amenities like hospitals, like schools for their children, and uh, the society will have more meat and more milk. So I think this is a very laudable project. And we thank God we have vast land in the north. It's enough for them. And uh, anybody who wants to copy it, I think privately too, can have also form a private ruga, in which way it can be uh, also a commercial, what do you call it, uh, project. <coughs> Apart from visiting the Ruga, what will you be doing in the forest? Station? Yes, we we like to meet with some uh, from some active uh, uh, active Fulani headsmen. We want to see sit down with them, discuss with them, show them the way, and also uh, discuss with the st state government and see how we can bring peace into this nation.